Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Hallie. I am so glad you are here. I decided that I wanted to do a little spring try on haul for this season. I'm just getting into the spirit of spring and everything. I put a couple looks together that I'm very excited about, this being one of them. I did my best to try to steam the clothing, so hopefully there's not too many wrinkles, but these are items that I have collected over the years, so it's not necessarily anything that is... I mean, some of it is current, but a lot of these pieces are very classic and they are pieces that I've been able to wear season after season and year after year. So I just try to take really good care of my clothing so that I can wear it year after year, as long as it's still in style and everything. And so, yeah, I try to buy fun pieces that are, um, that really like reflect my personality and just stuff that I'm excited to wear because if you're not excited to wear it, then you're never going to wear it and it's just going to sit in your closet. So anyway, yes, I have put my little filming corner together. As you can see, I don't have a chair yet, but I don't really need one for today since I'm going to be standing and showing all of the clothes. So like I said, some of the items are current and I can link them down below and any of the items that I've maybe bought, um, you know, last year or the year before that aren't really on sale right now, I will link dupes for them or I will link stuff that is very very similar down in the description so make sure to check that out and yeah I'm just gonna swing right into the haul okay so oh starting with this lovely piece this beauty I actually got from sorry it's a little bit wrinkly um I actually got from the boutique that I work at it is just stunning I love it so much it is so springy and it just has these really fun like puffer sleeves and of course the blue flowers are just stunning on it. It's so Easter, it's so spring. I'm definitely going to be using it or wearing it for Easter. So I just paired it with um, these super high-waisted jeans. I just love a high-waisted jean. So there's just a little bit of the skin showing, but, and then let me just scoot into the corner where you can see my shoes. <laughs> these are just stunning free people. I feel like they give me very much like 70s vibes. Let me just balance real quick, but Yes, they're giving 70s vibes. They are actually so comfortable. They're a good four inch heel, like she's not kidding. I am now like 5'7 in these, but yeah, they are just so stinking cute. I just couldn't pass them up when they came into the boutique and I wanted to buy them instantly. I love the blue pattern with the blue jeans. And then I love blue and brown together for spring. I feel like that will always be a classic combination for like spring and summer. So. Yeah, that is, this is the look. It just has this small little button in the back um, to just kind of clasp the neckline or whatever. But yeah, it has the puff sleeves and everything. I love this piece, so. Here is the shoe a little bit closer up and at the right angle. It's just kind of like a darker brown, but I love the detailing on it. Got a four inch heel. This is the inline inseam whatever you call it but yeah free people really really cute oh and this is like legit wood so anyway yeah beautiful i'll be putting these in a lot more of my outfits as well i got this at the boutique that i work at as well i love the neckline and everything it's just straight across and it's really nice because you can wear like a regular bra with this but i love the shoulders on it they're just so flowy and fun and like that's the side of it but it is a romper so i prefer a romper over a dress any day of the week this with the same heels here and again just that white and brown combo is so cute i feel like this would be so cute for like a bride and uh, it has pockets too which is just the absolute best but it's got the detailing kind of band right here that's really high-waisted so um it just kind of cinches you in right here and makes it a really flattering cut but yeah this is the side of it this is the back, just the same straight across. You could always wear this obviously with like sandals if you're not a heels girly like me. I love a good heel, I'm 5'3", so I'm like, bring it on, I love a good heel. White especially with a tan. I'm not super tan right now, but it just looks so clean and crisp and yeah, very feminine and everything. Okay, this one is so Easter. <laughs> like, I usually don't dress this brightly colored. I'm usually a neutrals girly, but I got some hand-me-downs for my sister. So here we are. <laughs> I am so happy that these jean skirts are coming back into style. I wore them religiously in high school and they're just like the snap buttons. And so they're so cute. I feel like it's just like something different and a little bit more feminine and a little bit more like stepped up than just like jeans or just 
um, like jean shorts. So yeah, it just adds a little bit more interest, I feel. And then I just paired it with this super cute little cardigan. So like Easter vibes and pretty, and it has these little pink flowers with the green and everything. But yeah, a beautiful light blue color. I just have it with a ribbed mock neck. So super simple. Paired it with these shoes. This is kind of like a little extra. Obviously you could wear it with chucks or um air force ones these are the platform converse if you had these and like i'm obsessed with the cream color i really want to get the cream color of these um that would be so cute with this outfit or just some regular schmegular air force ones mine are dirty sorry but nice clean white crisp <laughs> air force one with this outfit would be so cute too just to kind of dress it down and just make it a little bit more like easy and more casual but yeah and i just realized that a lot of these skirts go past your fingers tips so if you're like in school or something and you're looking for something to wear besides like jean shorts or like something that's school appropriate i feel like this is a very school appropriate outfit if you wear like tennies with it um because i know that like for me when i was in school the fingertip roll was a thing so you had to like have your fingertips down and it like go past your fingertips so yeah i feel like depending on where you are and depending what your school rules are and stuff this could fly as well Okay, this one is new. I'm so excited about this one. Oh, a monochrome suit set. Okay. It's just kind of a play, obviously, on a normal suit. This is that, uh, I can't remember the name of it. This is like a cotton and nylon blend. I feel like it's called something, so I will put the name on the screen if I remember it but it has these stripes. So cute. Just like adds some pattern to it. And then I just have it with the same little mock neck from the last outfit. If I had one, I would pair this with a dark brown mock neck. Or if it's like really warm where you live, a dark brown tank top. I think that would be really cute because the stripes in this are like tan. But if you're looking for like a monochrome vibe, this is it. I also, let me go into my corner real quick so you can see the shoes. So yeah, I pop these with the shoes and yeah, I just feel like it looks so springy cute this oh i have an idea throw on a little cropped jean jacket this is super cute too i might even like this better but yeah just kind of dresses it down and it's not so matchy matchy if you don't like that but i do love a good set but yeah sorry if everything's so wrinkly i literally don't know why i think it's because my closet is super small you would have seen in my last video so anyway okay this is one of my favorites as well this is a recent purchase from target yeah, Target. Target has really stepped up their game. Okay, the only complaint I have about this is that she's wrinkly. Like, oh my god. I probably spent 15 minutes trying to steam every single wrinkle out of this, and I feel like it doesn't look like that happened at all. So that's my only complaint about this, but I'm sure if I could like toss it in the dryer or something, like holy cow. Wow, wow, wow. This is cinched right here, so that's supposed to be wrinkly, but like oh my gosh um yeah so ignore that but <laughs> otherwise this is such a cute little stable stable piece and yeah i just paired it with these chucks like i said before these are the platform chucks the all-stars and these are like the leather ones but yeah that's what i'd wear this with and then i just have some gold jewelry by 1998 that I always wear and then just this simple gold. I absolutely love this outfit. It's one of my favorites and honestly like a go-to when going out and doing like fun things with friends. But I just have this graphic tee on and it's a Guns N' Roses little graphic tee. I think this was thrifted. I can get these at the Goodwill Salvation Army. This one is hemmed um, but you can always just raw cut it and then have it be a little crop. But yeah, I always match this shirt for the most part with these fun dangly earrings. They're so big and so just like kind of out there. But um, I got these long ago. Oh, even like with your hair up with a big earring, it's a look. Or with a claw clip, stop. I mean like not like that, but like stop. So cute. I got these earrings years ago for like a 70s themed date party i think my junior year of college 
and they just stuck with me. I just wear them on like fun special occasions, drinks with the girls, eatery a, if you know, you know. Um, and yeah, I just think it kind of goes with the fun colors in the top. This skirt is a tiny bit big on me. I do usually have to pin it when I wear it, but I love a cheetah print. Like, let me just show the whole thing. There we go. Okay. It's so cute. It is like the perfect length. It's just like to my shins right here. I feel like you can throw on, I do uh, throw on a little jean jacket with it if you need like an extra layer it, oh i never talked about this jacket this is a thrifted item as well and it came raw hemmed i love the little buttons on it i think it's so cute and just like a cute little touch i have this little green ring too that kind of go with the earrings and yeah this is the full outfit i feel like with this you um can wear any one of the shoes my classic go-to's we all know these you could definitely wear Air Force Ones with this outfit as well. Just dress it down. You could dress it up and wear a brown heel. I think that would be really, really cute with it too. Like that, can you imagine? I love these shoes for just a solid winery. Like so cute with the white top. Mm, cute, cute. And to me, J Print never goes out of style. I just love this. So I will forever have it. <laughs> okay, I love this little look. This is definitely more casual than the other outfits it's casual but it is not like lazy girl it is actually it doesn't look like bummy it looks very like put together and cute and sweet so yeah this is the outfit i've just layered a little cropped jacket with um a jean jacket and i just love the look of like the hood and the jean i feel like that looks so cute and then just my flared leggings you can do this obviously with straight leggings or whatever Double. Or whatever type of leggings that you want to, but I love these these flared leggings and then um, just Air Force Ones top it all off. Yeah, I just feel like it is a step up from just like a sweatshirt and leggings and it just looks a little bit more put together, a little bit more like springy with the jean jacket and still looks cute and with the crop it cuts you at like a good height and a good length where it's um covering you if you're going to school or work or running errands or whatever you don't want like your midriff showing so it covers you but it also cuts you at like a good length with a little crop jacket anyway i think that's gonna be all I hope this gave you guys some spring inspiration for your outfits. I hope it also motivated you to kind of find some things in your closet. Like I said, I'll link everything down below. You know, I know social media and YouTube in particular can actually TikTok in particular, but we're not going to go there today. Um, can make me feel really defeated after watching a YouTube video or a TikTok or anything like that. And so I never want my videos to ever make anybody feel like they need to go like buy the latest things or buy what I have or whatever. Um, the links down below or are just if you guys are curious or if you guys, you know, have been looking for um, something like this or have become inspired. But again, I never want to make anybody feel like they don't have enough or they don't do enough or they aren't um, like fashionable enough or whatever. Whatever it is I don't have the latest things I don't you know go out and buy to buy or shop to shop I don't really have the money to do that and it's not a woe is me type of thing I like to spend my money on travel on food on hanging out with friends and other things like that so really I've kind of curated these looks and curated a lot of my outfits and a lot of my pieces and clothing items for years and so yeah please don't feel like you like need to buy any of this, these things or anything like that you can always make your outfits your own thrifting is a great way to find really unique and personable items that go with your personality and will make your outfits truly truly yours because you've curated them and you've gone out and looked at those items so anyway i'm just kind of rambling right now but i just wanted to say that because i know social media can be very confusing and very um hyper trend like hyper trendy if that makes sense where everybody is just trying to get to the next thing as fast as they possibly can and i am here to tell you i'm like amped up right now that's why i'm talking so fast but i'm here to tell you that you do not need to go out and buy the latest looks i try to go for more classic looks and what's in style anyway rant done i love you guys so much subscribe down below if you're interested in seeing more videos like this comment if you want more videos um like this or kind of like what style you guys like the most this was so much fun to film this is the first ever video i've done kind of in this style but i would love to do more and yeah just let me know what you guys want to see i'll see you guys in my next video bye